You did that. It's harder for the enemy who's peeking. Yes. Let me tell you a secret, okay? Let it be between me and you. Listen. Let me tell you a secret, and let it be between me and us, guys. In Tarkov, the aggressor has the... The one who's standing still has a dis disadvantage. The aggressor always had an advantage. If you stand still, you fucked. This is it. It's a peaker advantage. I'm gonna see him for it before he's... The client? The game client. The game client works like that. If you peek first, if you if you rush it and you peek first, you're gonna see him first. Okay. Because of the bad network, exactly. You set donated five dollars. Well, Terry goes my five bucks. Thank you so much for the five dollars, man. Appreciate that. Yeah, Shafin, thank you so much for the two months. What's up, people at work? Let's go, baby. What's up? So, just so you guys know it. Be the aggressor. Don't be the guy in the corner. You're gonna die. Okay? Don't be that guy. But, there's a huge bud. If you push, and the guy moves at the same time, the fight will be even. Remember that. Remember that. Nice. If the guy push... Like, if you push and the guy moves and push towards the corner you're fighting, or push to the left, it will catch you off guard and you will die. So it goes both way. Yeah. It goes both way, guys. Remember that. What's up, Taco? How you doing? What's up, Roku? Showline yet? No, Pordy, I have not. What's up, Crazy? How you doing, man? Yeah, exactly, Coca. Yo, good morning, Unhin Unhinged. How you doing, homie? Nice to see you, bro. Good morning, X Alvin. Uh, 100%, Koki. 100%, man. He was left side peak too, backed himself into an unwinnable situation. Oh yeah, indeed. And that's why, I don't know if you saw it, Lee. First of all, thank you for the 500 bits. I don't know if you saw it. Like, before I peeked this corner, I had to make sure he was, like... I had to, first of all, I had to make sure that when I did this, he wasn't here. And then, the next was here. But this would be... This would peak, uh, put me in a disadvantage because if I peek like this, I'm gonna die. So that's why I did like this, bro. I don't know if you saw it. You know? So I had I had to make sure to cut this angle off and peek this corner first because this corner here is the first danger like danger zone. And then we have this corner and then we have this corner. So that's why I had to I had to clear this one like close right first. That's why I sprint like that and. You know, peek this corner first. You have to, bro, guys, you have to cut it in pieces. Because if I do this, bro, I'm dead. If he could have, like, he can be there, he can be there, he can be there. This is dangerous. And also because I'm peeking with the left shoulder. It's really important. Before moving, think about your surroundings. Think about how you're going to engage a fight. So that's why, in this situation right here, you don't want to stand still in, in, this, in this area. So what you do... Sprint and peek it. Then you're cutting off this, all this. Peek here, he's not here. Then, not here, not here. And then I got the sound. I don't know if y'all realized. I got a sound on my left side. So that means when I did like this, he's not here. And I looked at the door, the, the door is closed. So I knew, okay, the door is closed. He's either inside, he's either inside or he's right around this corner. And that's why I did like this. Not like that, but more like this. And shot him while while being while using inertia for me to slide. Remember, inertia is a big thing. So I use the momentum I'm getting with the sprinting 
and going to the right. So I use inertia to slide to the right. Because it's, it's going to make me slide. And when it makes me slide, it's going to make people harder for me to track the aim. Unless they're really good at it. But you don't really see people very good at tracking the aim. So remember to use the inertia with you. That's why I, I, rush, I rush like this and like that. It's very important, guys. Use the inertia in your behalf. So, I don't really talk about this, but remember that, guys. Inertia is a big thing in this game now. And you have to adapt. If you don't adapt, you know what's going to happen. No, seriously. Inertia is a big thing now. Okay. Easy YouTube content. Let's go! YouTube content! Alright. That's too often. But I do sometimes. You sh Bro, listen. Using inertia is actually like... A lot of people are like, dude, oh, I hate inertia. Adapt it, and I promise you. You're gonna fuck him up. Fights rogues at water? Yeah, but I have 556. Five, yeah, that's double headshot or triple headshot. Oh, yeah. Inertia is healthy for the game. Also for the future. I saw a clip yesterday. I'm gonna show you guys a clip, okay? I'm gonna show you guys a clip of me from yesterday. Y'all need to see the movement, okay? I posted on Instagram story. Y'all really need to see. Y'all really need to see the the old labs, dude. I was zooming, dude. I was thinking that uh, would be a great YouTube short. 100% people, 100%. 100%. I clipped it. I mean, I marked it, so why not? <laughs> Let's go, Duddy. Enjoy your food, monkey. What's up, Maluk Malukui? How you doing, Maluk? I saw the clip. Did you see how fast I was zooming around, dude? It was beautiful. <sighs> what does smashing your face into the wall before you do peek do? Well, basically, I don't know if you saw it. I sp I ran towards the wall, and then being close to the wall, when I corner peek, like when I run towards the corner, I'm gonna have a wider peek instead of uh, having a shorter, like short wide peek. Does that make sense? Like, um. If I go like this, like, let's pretend this is a wall. Let's pretend this is a wall. If I peek like this, it's going to be wide. But if I go like this, it's going to be short. You see the difference? So if I peek like this, I'm peeking wide. Right? Like, the peek I do is wide. But if I go close to the wall, and I do this, it's short. And I see you before, like, I see you around the corner before you even being able to see me. Because, yeah, exactly. My field of view is going to change a lot faster when I'm right around the corner instead of peeking it wide. You have to think about these things. Supreme netcode? No, I'm just saying, bro. Th these are the stuff you need to think about in a PvP situation. You PvP is like chess, bro. You have to outplay your enemy. Don't play the enemy's game, but let the enemy play in your terms. That's how you win most, most of the fights.